notable non-tenders by teams as we take a look at that. Addison Russell with the Cubs, Blake Trinan with the A's, Kevin Pillar with the Giants, Kevin Gosman with Cincinnati, Travis Sean Milwaukee, and then the Phillies cutting ties with Michael Franco and Cesar Hernandez. Trinan's that interesting name out there right now, Jack. He has had success, pitched to an ERA of plus four the past season, but I think when you're looking at some of the analytics and making projections, teams are probably high on him. Find 2018 if you're Blake Trinan. And that's what you're hoping for the team that is going to sign him because someone will sign him. Look at those numbers in 2018. He had an ERA of under one, the opponent's batting average at 158. He had an almost unhittable sinker. Now he fell off the cliff a little bit last year. But I think there are teams out there that are going to say, oh, we'll sign this guy to a major league deal. We'll give him X amount of money because we think there's still a good pitcher in there. We think he can find that sinker that he lost last year with the A's. If I'm a scout, and I'm scouting trying and I did some Oakland days games last year and you watch him pitch and you see the velocity and you see the movement you're almost scratching your head how can the ERA be as high as it was and it tells me that maybe he's a guy that just got out of out of whack a little bit mechanically and the confidence took a big time dive to Jack's point he's gonna get paid a pretty good number and it's a gamble for some clubs but when you have that arm velocity and movement it's a calculated gamble well